everybody it's been such a long time i'm finally back to youtube if you don't know me already it's your girl rakaya i used to go by rocky my nickname but i decided to go by my real name my artist name and i'm so excited to be back to youtube and what other way to come back with my first experience being a part of a k-pop writing camp in person it's been some time since i've been on youtube you know a lot of things have changed i'm no longer like an aeronautical or aerospace engineer i quit that over a year ago to pursue my passion in music and it has been amazing yet very challenging to be a independent music artist but right now all i have to say is i'm super grateful if you haven't checked out my most recent ep into the cosmos it's on all platforms right now you can go check out all my other songs in my discography but i'm pretty new to making music and to be so new to be blessed with the opportunity to be you know a professional songwriter has been super awesome i was invited to a k-pop writing camp out in California. It was your girl first time in Cali. Yes, it was so much fun. Thanks to a good friend, Jofro, who's also a songwriter in K-pop. He wrote on Jopping. So he reached out to me about sometime this year, became friends and been wanting to work with me as a songwriter. I'm like, I'm down. And lo and behold, last minute was a camp and I'm like, I gotta come in person. Jofro gave me another opportunity through him directly in Warner Chapel to write for a few of some of our favorite uh, K-pop girl groups and K-pop boy groups and even C-pop. Follow me on Instagram at Rakaya. You can follow me on Twitter as well. So if you wanna shop at my website or check out my space diary or anything, my music or videos or whatever, you guys can always visit my personal official website, rakayainspace.com. So that's my new life now. So if you're interested in all my upcoming content around making K-pop songs or any series I plan to do about me and music, you're more than welcome to stay on the channel. All my old videos, I will keep up. And hopefully I get to go back to Korea next year for some Korean language studying or even K-pop writing camps there. So just stay tuned and follow me everywhere if you wanna see my awesome journey. This vlog is compiled of random clips throughout the writing camp. Obviously I can't disclose, but so much. I can't really show you guys the song, obviously. Um, but a lot of the writing is for SM, um, SM boy groups, girl groups. I can't say who for most part because some of them are having comebacks and I can't be the one to spoil them. But just watch the video and see kind of like how it goes. Mind you, I just landed back home in Jersey. So this camp was just recent. So sometimes it takes about three to six months to find out if you play. So keep me in your thoughts and prayers. Wish me good luck and enjoy the vlog. You. It's your boy, Jocko Dobbins. Chilling right here with Rakaya. Hey. Shana, Malik Smith. This is what they but they knocked out. <laughs> they knocked out, but what time is it now? Shit, almost midnight. Almost midnight here in Cali. <laughs> Busting out a track for one of your fave girl groups, K-pop girl groups. We've been working at it the whole time, killing it. Can't tell you who, can't tell sorry. You, can't tell you who, y'all. Can't tell you who <laughs> yet. <laughs> Homie's house 
outlaw to finish writing the girl group tracks. Ready to let go, everybody? I'm the city. <laughs> <laughs> I want to do this, something like this for. Oh, yeah, because that's the, the second lead they had on there was. Pause. Okay, little quick information. Fun fact. When you are given songs to write for said artist or group, you're usually giving a lead. And in the lead documents, you'll see something called a brief. So pretty much, let's say SM will say, hey, we want a song for this group, this group, this group, or this solo act, and we're going for this sound. Here are some reference tracks of what we kind of want it to sound like. Sometimes they even may mention the key of the singers or any other specifics, or just kind of like, hey, we kind of just want this vibe. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Hey, boy, gang, boy, gang. boy, ain't no way. We got the oil, this, and this, boy. Ain't no way, boy. K-pop camp, K-pop camp, J-pop, C-pop, we doing all the pop and sweet. ABC, D-pop. ABC, D-pop. Getting lit with amazing writers, amazing producers today. You know Boy, no way, boy. Hip-hop. For your documentary. Hip-hop. Hip-hop papatomus. This is Joe Thomas. Hip-hop papatomus. I just can't stop. Rakaia, this. You want to introduce something to the camera? What's poppin'? Shayna Ray. Shayna Ray. Mm. Shayna Ray. Mm. Big back and you back. And you know fam. Fam over here? Boy, no way, boy. Boy, no way, boy. Boy, no way, boy, 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 boy. The one and only outlaw. Jekyll Ryder here. Yeah, we got Joppy Ryder right here. We also, <laughs> we also have here. Come on, man, tell me who you are. Rakim. Some places. Tell me who you are. Social building. Jopping. Hey, jumping, jumping, we jumping, we jumping, jumping. I'm gonna give a boy throwing three stacks. I'm gonna show you how to ball your MS I can't show you guys the songs for obvious reasons, but as you can tell, we're jamming to it because it's such a bop. <laughs> we're all done wrapping this one up for now. Thank you, thank you. Get, the, get out of here. <laughs> hey. Can't day three. <laughs> the right production people. No. And the Literally. Right ideas, you have crazy ideas, ideas you know, like, yo. Like, A three kind of got lost. But anyway, hey guys, we're back again on day. I don't even know anymore. This can be like day six, day five of K-pop writing camp here in Cali. I am now with a new group for the rest of the camp. Meet Rx. So, <laughs> let the people know um, what you've written already. Yes, uh, I was part of writing my time for BTS. Okay, Army, that was for you. <laughs> but today we're back at it again. I think we're doing a boy group today. Just the other day, we wrapped up doing a C pop girl group, which was super, super fun. Mad fire. We can't wait. We're just fingers are we crossed. To, are we allowed to say who the group is? Are we allowed? <laughs> I don't know. Are we allowed to say who the group is? No, right? Oh, because I feel like I feel like I'm so I just stay away from naming. 
just in case they just in case they have or to maybe come the back label. like the label like a general okay uh we can say as if okay 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 well the c-pop girl group is we don't know what label the c-pop girl group is oh yeah but we did a c-pop girl group just the other day fire track a banger this is Joffro, guys. Yeah, boy. The Ooh, infamous this rap verse oh um, of Marks on Jopping. Yes. Yes, I'm with some heavy hitters. I'm with some bangers. So. But she acted like she's not the heaviest hitter of all. What the hell? No. He's gassy, yeah. No, but seriously, um, we've been doing SM earlier the first week. We switch up a little bit, go into C pop for a girl group. And now we're back again with SM for a boy group. We're super excited. We're hoping that we can get a placement on their album. Mm -hmm. We're bringing the hits, we're bringing the heat. And it's so awesome because I'm with other fellow like black creatives and writers and producers, which is a big deal because I think a lot of people don't realize how much of like black people or POC are behind K-pop, J-pop, C-pop. So stay tuned so we're going to vlog the rest. Or to the wise <laughs> sky. <laughs> enjoyed it if you have any um questions or anything you feel like you would love for me to vlog or document let me know down below i plan to maybe capture a lot more vlogs of my writing camps and future writing sessions even if it's not revolving around k-pop and it's western artists or western producers i will do the same i seriously had a blast with all of the writing camps i participated in california was fun everyone was super kind there had you know, their highs, the lows, but overall it was a really, really great experience. Just stay tuned for a lot more other videos. I'll be documenting and sharing different series about me just being an indie artist and the great things about it and the not so great and difficult things that a lot of people never told me about or I wish that someone made a YouTube video about. And check out my website, rakayaspace.com. Go stream my most recent EP and my most recent single and stay tuned if you are going to stay as an awesome subscriber i thank you if you felt like this is all that my channel has given you in the past i still appreciate you for watching Whew. here we go